Ferdinand wrote very eloquently about collecting um, and how he felt that eventually collections in private hands would pass into public museums and that that was right, that people should have access to these wonderful collections. And this was partly his intention in making the Wadston bequest, that the collection that he had formed should stay together in his name and be available and accessible to the public. There was also a practical reason for him making the bequest in that death duties had been introduced just a few years before and he was very aware and concerned about the future of Wadston for his heirs and that this gift to the British Museum would offset some of that tax. The Wadston bequest has been on display since 1900 in its own gallery and a catalogue was published as soon as 1902 with wonderful photographs of highlights of the collection and it's being redisplayed in June in a new gallery so that lots of people will be able to see it in its new location on the ground floor of the British Museum.